Hi, we're here at the Korean and USA Startup Summit 2022 at the Pier 17 in New York. And right now we are again on the Never Cloud booth. So thanks to this global partnership between Le Café de Geek, High Tech Media, myself, and Evening News, we are doing some interview. Here we are doing a new interview right now, again on the Never Cloud, I'll say, with Argos, Argos Dine. Okay. I don't want to say it wrong. Hi, nice to meet you. Yeah, nice to meet you. Yeah. So thank you for your time. Thank you for being here. Um, can you introduce us to the company? Ah uh, yes. So our company, Argos Dine, is uh, provide the unmanned drone system. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. We can operate the drone without a pilot. Okay. Yeah. And uh, and especially if the, we are developing the 5G AI drone. Yeah. With Qualcomm and Naver Cloud. Yeah. What is the, um, so if there's no one behind the drone, why a uh, company needs this drone? How is it used to? Ah, the drone is basically to fly the GPS signal, okay. but this drone can the GPS deny the environment, yeah, flying. And then it, this drone is specialized uh, the, under the bridge yeah. or the const photo construction. Yeah. For our the video clip, uh, you can uh, see the how to drone if the non-GPS uh, environment can uh, fly. Yeah. So uh, what is a drone looking for uh, in this particular case, ah, for example? Yeah. We are using the stereo camera and mm -hmm. uh, we calculate the stereo camera, the distance yeah, for AI. Yeah. So the drone is looking for any issues in the, in the building or what is the purpose of the drone? Ah, we are detecting the crack. Or, or the uh, damage, yeah, mm. expectation, yeah, yeah, okay. for the yeah, construction, building, or the bridge. Yeah. Okay, yeah. that makes a lot of sense because it's very difficult for human to go maybe in these areas, yeah. or even it's bridge are very long sometimes, so it needs a lot of time, so you can just send two drones, yeah. and it's doing the calculation by itself, right? Yes, right. And our drone is uh, flying time is around the, uh, over the 30, per, uh, 30 minutes. Okay. Yeah, so That's the, very good. it's very uh, sufficient time mm. to fly the, the one the bridge, bridge or yes. two bridges. And is, is it to time. change the battery? Uh, yes, it is to change the battery. But our system is that do, uh, do, uh, you do not need to change the battery. Okay. The, this is the drone station. Yeah. Uh, basically, have a function of the autonomous wireless charging. And after the drone flying, the drone uh, make a precision landing on a station okay. and then uh, charging and uh, prepare for the next mission. Mm, so yeah. wireless charging by uh, the base? Yes, right. Okay, that makes a lot of sense. It's very practical. And yes. Is there also the small uh, station autonomous? Yes, so we have a, a very specialized technology to minimize the landing error. Mm -hmm. yeah, so we can uh, make this station compact more size to uh, mount the vehicle, such as a car or auto, yeah, ground control system. Okay, that's very nice like for companies yeah. like, um, to look about their bridge or etc. Uh, are you only uh, offering your solution currently in Korea or in other country in the world? Mm -hmm. Up to now, so now is uh, using this drone solution is using in Korea as the maybe the two, uh, 20 yeah, construction company in mm -hmm. Korea. But now we are preparing for the uh, entering the US market. Okay. Yeah, yeah. So my next question is a follow up to that. And it's also uh, about the show. Uh, why are you in the show? But I think you already kind of replied to this question. Yeah, I'd like to uh, introduce our company mm -hmm. yeah, through this show. and. Uh, I uh, I so have uh, some meeting yeah for investor or the business partners uh, to the show our the new drone and uh, I'd like to show some another drone is a okay. 5G AI drone. Okay. Yeah. What's the difference between this one yeah. and this one? Uh, this one is can support the 5G environment. Okay. Yeah. And uh, in the 5G environment, the low latency. Yeah. And the processing of the massive. Uh, amount of data is to fit for the very uh, low attitude, uh, low altitude, yeah, structure, mm -hmm. yeah, and the buildings as uh, surveilling is very fit, uh, fitting for this drone. And okay. the embedded on device AI and 
they processing the uh, AI uh, analysis on in, uh, yeah, yeah, in this drone, yeah, yes. not uh, need for the okay. cloud. Yeah. Okay, and then uh, send the result by 5G to the operator. Yes, right. Okay, that makes a lot of sense. And uh, as we know, the construction market is huge, so yes. I hope you will be able to grow with it and find some uh, partner yeah. uh, here in the US and maybe more globally. Yeah, more globally. Especially the 5G communications, or maybe it's the global telecommunication companies that are interested in this drone. Yeah, because uh, uh, global telecom, uh, uh, that global telcos interested in the uh, initiate the new drone service. Yes. Yeah, yeah. yeah so. That's very true. Maybe it can be used for other solution for them also. Yes, right. To check the network. Yeah. <laughs> okay, yes. thank you very much for your time. Yeah, thank, thank you, you for being here. Yeah, and I hope you a uh, great future. Yes. Thank you. Goodbye. Thank you. Okay. Bye bye.